Patricia, thanks for coming in for your final evaluation. Um, you've done, I was really happy with your performance this quarter. You really have met all of the learning outcomes, and, and you've met them. But I want to try to challenge you as you move into your senior year in a couple of issues. Okay. I noticed as I went through a couple of things on some clinical reasoning, um, particularly in terms of your concept map, um, what, I, what I really noticed was you were having a difficult time prioritizing things. You know, as an LPN, you've learned to prioritize something different. Mm -hmm. And now as you move up into this role as an RN, we really want you to work on how you're prioritizing patient care. So you've met the learning outcomes, and we're happy with that. But let's, we're going to try to get you up a little bit higher as you move into your senior year. And some other things that I noticed in terms of delegation, uh, you were able to do that with, on your concept map, and you met those learning outcomes. But I realize that delegation is difficult, isn't it? Yeah, I believe it's that way at times, especially in the hospital setting, I yeah. think. And you, and you don't really have that opportunity to really delegate very much, right. particularly as a student. Mm -hmm. And as an LPN, do you get to delegate? Uh, just minor things, things really. Too. Okay. And so what we want to try to work on or think about are ways that we can delegate a little bit more effectively. Okay, and, and you can appreciate as you move up into this different role as an RN, that we're going to be calling on you to delegate. So, so that's something I want you to think about as you move into your senior year. Um, the other things that I noticed in terms of just being able to work with medications and in relationship to those diagnoses, you sometimes maybe had a difficult time understanding that connection. And so, what were some ways that you think that you could move forward in your senior year to take that up a notch? Well, I think that um, it was kind of, I kind of knew the medications and what might have gone with a certain disease, but I had a hard time putting together, like, the side effects and how things actually work as a whole, you know, what I would look for and what it was actually doing inside of the body. So I thought that was a good thing. That was something that was more in-depth than what I'd had before. So it made me more aware in that respect. Wow. So you really know that then, don't you? And so what we want you to do is in that senior year, let's try to take that up to that notch. Mm -hmm. Does that make sense to you? You feel comfortable I think it makes perfect okay. sense. I really have enjoyed working with you this whole semester. It's been a lot of fun for me to work with you. It's been exciting for me to watch you make these real positive transitional steps. Have, have you noticed that? Yeah, I actually enjoyed it. I was very nervous, sure. but I really enjoy really being to seeing the whole picture. And I've had a couple of instances where I really met with somebody that had endocarditis, and everything that I was learning about the things adhering to the leaflets of the valves and all the things that I had assessed, but I didn't see that they were actually part of what I was looking for in the disease. I started like, it was really exciting to like put those things together, so I was really excited. Well good, that's excellent. So, well thanks for coming in for your final evaluation. And at any time next semester, if there's any issues or any ways I can help you, I know you move on to another instructor, mm -hmm. please always feel free to contact me. You're quite welcome. Thank you Thank very you. much.